Since the coronavirus pandemic caused companies to close nearly two months ago, we've been highlighting local businesses that are still finding ways to safely serve their customers. A Lexington hotspot for a cold treat is busy filling orders. In tonight's We're Open Kentucky, Angie Bevan talks to the owner and creator of Crank and Boom Ice Cream. Like most businesses, it began with a simple idea. When we started, it, it literally was in a two-quart Cuisinart home ice cream maker, and I was just making coconut ice cream for our Thai restaurant. We started to dream, you know, these crazy dreams like, oh, maybe we would, uh, you know, go sell uh, ice cream in Kroger one day. But it wasn't crazy, not at all. Since 2013, Crank and Boom has operated a cart, opened two shops in Lexington, and the Kraft ice cream is sold in 40 retail locations in Kentucky and some in Ohio. Owner Tal Green uses local ingredients to create the unique ice cream. We have a really special way that we make it that's different than um, anyone else. Um, we do really fun flavors. When the ice cream shop had to close its doors to people in March, it was a big change, but nothing that made Green panic. Since we started in 2013, every year the way our business has been run has been completely different. We've always changed really fast and changed really well. We had put some things in place last year to diversify what we're doing. We do nationwide shipping now, which was already set in place, which has helped us a lot. And you can do curbside pickup at the Lexington locations. Crank and Boom also offers same day home delivery. The unique product made them popular and the service has made them a favorite. I think our team and the people that you interact with when you get your ice cream, whether it's at a festival or even in curbside behind a mask, um, you'll get that same level of love and service. And to spread the love, Crank and Boom has given back during these tough times, donating more than $16,000 from sales of ice cream. Pretty sweet. In Lexington, Angie Bevan, LEX 18 News.